Well, IMSA promoting its new program for those interested in getting their EMT certifications. It's called IMSA Advantage. News Force Natalie Clydesdale sat down on a class. She has the details. It's a, it's a very important job. It's just instrumental in providing that first line care. If you could picture yourself filling that role, rushing to the scene of an emergency or caring for a patient on the way to a hospital, you may want to check out the new program, EMSA Advantage. We bring on people that are interested in becoming EMTs that are not currently certified. Uh, we hire them full time, benefits, pay, all that. And we put them through a nine week in-house school uh, to prepare them for the national registry exam. The program is part of a partnership between EMSA and Oklahoma State University Fire Service Training. While taking the course, students will be paid $12.75 an hour, and at the end of the nine weeks, they'll take an EMT certification test. After they have successfully passed their NRMT exam, then uh, we put them to our in-house academy. We talk about geography, uh, the driving and um, layouts of our trucks, and specifically our protocols that we use here at IMSA. It's closest to 3212 Northwest 32nd. During the academy, students will be making EMT pay just over $16 an hour. They'll have four more weeks after that of field training, and then... You're already hired on, and we want to keep you here. The deal is you have to fulfill an 18-month contract, but Michael Wilson says he hopes they'll stick around for much longer. So far, about 60 students have gone through the program. Susan Heider is currently in the academy. Um, so I was working in an emergency department before I came here. So what attracted me to EMSA in particular um, was not only the culture, but the fact that you get paid to come to class. She says she highly recommends the EMSA Advantage program to any aspiring EMTs. You're not having to pay for uh, the course materials and everything, and then as long as you pass, you're guaranteed a job. Natalie Clydesdale, Oklahoma's News 4. The next classes will start in August, and we have a link to apply for that program at KFOR.com.